Iraqi forces are roughly 24 hours into their U.S.-backed offensive to drive the so-called Islamic State from the northern city of Mosul. Iraq's Prime Minister Haider al-Abadi made a televised statement on Monday announcing the start of the mission. The ISIS-linked AMAC news agency said its fighters had launched 10 suicide attacks on advancing forces near Mosul and that Peshmerga forces had encircled five villages but failed to take them. According to journalists and NGOs in the area, thousands of people are trapped inside the city as ISIS militants have threatened to shoot any civilians trying to get out. The commander of the coalition, U.S. Lieutenant General Stephen Townsend, said the operation would likely continue for weeks or possibly even longer if Mosul is retaken. Raqqa in Syria will be the Islamic State's last remaining stronghold.